Hello YouTube fans, here again and now when it comes to remakes I'd never want to see this I'm hoping could be true and it might not be true but I have heard rumours that Steven Spielberg that's right, the man himself Steven Spielberg was going and thinking I should say of doing a remake now for people who want to know what the remake is I'm on about, I'm on about a remake of the film that made his name, not E.T. Jaws, you know, bum 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 <laughs> Jaws. Of all the films Steven Spielberg was thinking of remaking, he was thinking of remaking the film what became a tacit, the film that he directed all the way back in 1975. He was thinking of remaking it and I'm hoping and you remember me doing this when I was ranting on a remake of Star Wars? I am hoping that Steven Spielberg has had a change of art. I say that again. I'm hoping he had a change of art. Steven Spielberg, I love you, mate. I love you. Please, please, for the love of normality, do not remake your film. Jaws. Do not do it. And the reason why I say don't do it... It's because he's not going to have the same matte it than the original. I'll tell you what it's going to have. Right? I'll tell you what it's going to have. And like good actors like Roy Sider, Richard Tavis and so on. This is the actors you are going to get people. You ready for this? Pieces of fucking wood. You probably have a pity boy playing Roy Sider's character. That being said it's bolder. You have a pity boy playing the role. You have a pity boy. Now, if you want to see someone who did a better review than what I'm doing now about We Do Not Want A Jaws to Remake, there was one on YouTube. I can't remember the name of it, but if you ever find, if I can ever find it, if I can ever find it, I'll diff to the link. I'll say it again. I'll diff to the link because at the end of the day, it does a better one. Because normally I'm not allowed to sell bits and bobs of the film. And I've got the film, I've got all of them except for Jaws to be friends. You've already seen the rant on that. But yeah, he does a better, better review than what I'm doing now. Because he does it all. And it's like I said, you get a pretty boy but playing Roy Sider's role. And I'm telling you this from from the love of art, I'm doing this straight away. You have a shitty CDR sack. You have a shitty CDR sack. It'll be sack, sack, CDR sack or dazzle. It'll be a CDR fucking sack or dazzle. You see, when Stephen, the reason why Steven Spielberg, right, and I could be right and wrong on this, these are just rumours. The reason why he thought about rebooting it, remaking it, and reshitting it was because he never saw a lot of the sack. I know, I know over the years people laughed at it and made fun of it and said, oh, that whooper sack. But I like the way it looked. I too sat over shitty CTR. Any day of the week, I say it again, any day of the fucking week, I would choose that over CGR. And it went all past its arts, bits underwater was real footage, filmed by an Australian couple that used to do a lot of filming of sarts, whether it's Tiders, Amers and Jake Wrights. What did them date underwater scenes of a real Jake Wright sart? The scene where it's attacking the boat, which in real life is a biotopher. I recommend look at the biotopy because it wasn't attacking the sack. The, the sack. <laughs> it wasn't attacking the ship, I meant to say. It got stuck on the ship. It does look like it was attacking it. And the scene where you think it's attacking Richard Tavers, right? So, the reason why he, did, he wanted to make the remake, get to that point, was because he didn't like the fact he barely saw the sack. The sack, what they moved, the mechanical sack was always breaking down. There's no good biotopy. Gold, the sack is not working. You see, when Steven Spielberg was making the film, instead of drawing it the Tate White sack, he was drawing it the Tate White turd because he hated the mechanical sack. But I think it rubbed off. I've got to admit, I think it fucking rubbed off because the scene where it kills the little kidder, right? Now, I do know there was a, a very rare footage of that where the sack did work and they had a fake dummy boy. I mean, that we're going to see the sacks eating kids. I like the way it is because you don't see it and you see it drag him under the water. You see the dust of blood and you hear that audible sound. The bit where it kills the deer, that beautiful deer, which supposed to be topless, but don't get excited, lads, in real life. She wasn't topless. 
the bits where you don't see makes it more starey. Makes it more starey. It just that expense to it. So when you do see the sack and the bit where Roy Sider says we're going to need a bit of bolt, I think that made the film. It made it. It gave it that horror feel. It was an horror. It was an adventure. And it was a man take on a monster, that being a Tate White Sark. And yeah, over a couple of years later, it launched a sequel, that being Tors 2. And it made Tors 3. A lot of people would suit Tors 3, but in all fairness, I can watch Tors 3 as a time waster. Tors 2 with friends, well, you've seen the rant on that, it's a piece of shit. But me, I have no problems with Jaws. Jaws to me is a classic. It's a classic. And yeah, when I first saw it as a kid, I did spend most of my time in under the city. Because it had that effect on me. Not because I was underage at the time for watching that film, but it had the head for me. It was scary. And the music, the music is iconic. You're never going to get that atmosphere now. The first time you hear that John Williams theme tune, you know, dun 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 I'm not gonna do the rest, but you know what I mean. Everybody, everybody, even people who weren't even born or weren't even around in that era is gonna know the Jaws theme. You're gonna know the Jaws theme. You cannot do the film and tight lightning in a buckle. Steven Spielberg made a dudden and do the fact that he's gonna fucking remake it. I'm just hoping, I'm hoping that he's gonna have a change of art. I'm just hoping he's going to have a fucking change of art and not remake a damn dud classic. Doesn't need remaking. Steven Spielberg, please, mate, please do not remake your film. That being Jaws. I'll just I'll say it again. It's not going to have to say Matt it. It's not going to have to say atmosphere. You're going to have a shitty CTR sack. The stairs, you know, are going to be coming. The jump stairs. Are going to be coming along, are going to be coming, you know it, straight away. You know when the jump stairs are going to be there. It's not going to have the same charm on it. It's just going to be Stephen Spielberg tasting on a brand name. That's all it is. It's Stephen Spielberg tasting on a fucking brand name. You know what I mean? Should I say more? That's what it is. It's Stephen Spielberg tasting in on a fucking brand name. I mean, he died to do it with Indiana Jones, where you had fucking Dan Dad, Indiana Jones. Did it work? No. So it's like, why is he doing films? He's done days and days ago. You know what I mean? Why? To me, Jaws, back in that eight day from the, the, the mid-70s, that being 1975, you were not going to tax lightning in a buckle. You're not going to do it. It's impossible to get lightning in a buckle and have the same impact what you did all the way back then for them audience. You can't do it. You know what I mean? The real other Jake Sark movies, look, think about it. Deep Blue Sea. Another Jake Sark films like Sallow Water. So, if Steven Spielberg wants to have maybe a Cheats of Feet or a monster film or another film similar to Doors, bring something like that out. He doesn't have to remake in my eyes, a film which, in my eyes, is a classic. So, no, people, no. I do not want to see Jaws, the remake, the take right turn, as I will call it, if he did. Because you're trying to see, it's not going to have the same map to it. You're going to have pity boys and pity girls and a pity boy playing Seri Boulder. You're not going to have the same time what it had all the way back in that era, in my eyes. It'll be a piece of shit. Into then, bum 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 bum. See you later.